A strong response. Vice President Kamala Harris hits back tonight after Donald Trump's comments today questioning her racial identity. Plus, peaceful protests, the message a local advocacy group delivered tonight after the controversial death of Sonia Massey. And tracking relief from the high heat, Local 6 at 10 starts right now. WPSD Local 6, your breaking news and weather authority. This is Local 6, Olympic edition. Tonight, our weather authority alert continues for extreme heat and humidity. That's right. Temperatures continue feeling like they're in the triple digits. Meteorologist Jennifer Rukavina joins us. Jennifer, how high will temperatures get tomorrow? We're pretty much in the same category as where we were today. We'll look for high temperatures in the mid-90s across much of the area. Notice here, though, the excessive heat warning was expanded today to also include those in the Penny Raw region and down through the Lakes area in Tennessee. The exception, Stewart County under heat advisory for tomorrow. That means heat index values will be 110 to even close to 120 in some locations. If we can get some cloud cover in here and maybe some thunderstorms during the afternoon, that will help cool a few places off. But what's so dangerous about this heat is it is cumulative. So even though yesterday, maybe today, you didn't feel any impacts from the heat, tomorrow might be that day. Those impacts continue because the overnights, we get very little relief. We're going to look at when that relief is headed our way coming up in just a few minutes. To keep track of the heat, download the Local 6 Weather app. Be sure to enable push alerts. Again in Friday.